Hello guys, my name is Kimin Egg, the man who has wanted to kill himself ever since the beginning of the last April due to one single thing called an excessive offensive launch on me by my freaking allergies. Jesus, they are annoying, and they have been only getting worse and worse with each passing week. Seriously, at this point I get troubles not sneezing for like 5 fucking minutes, and surprisingly right now I'm not sneezing at all, so I decided to make a couple of videos. Well, a couple of videos. I pretty much just will record like three videos or something like that in a row and hope that I'm not gonna start sneezing. And my buddy is currently wanna deny me the chance of actually recording these videos. You can probably hear them in the background sometimes randomly screeching like fucking gargoyles. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Also, I just noticed that this sniper rifle looks surprisingly well with my gauge skin because seriously. Uh, my gauge is like this wall, fiery kind of in color, and like, you know, the sniper rifle's uh, camo looks surprisingly nice with it. Not to mention that it has this tiny little detail on the scope, the Pedant 4521, and the Maiden Pandora. What the hell are you? I must accept the ground looks quite enthralling, doesn't it? Alright, uh, alright, alright. I was supposed to do the Rockaholics Anonymous quest. Pick up Kexo beer. That doesn't sound as the main quest. Give me a second. <laughs> uh, this is the story mission. It is for the level 21, so exactly my level. Uh, alright. Go to opportunity. Uh, wasn't I supposed to go to Moxie first? I do have a feeling like she has not only a quest for me. You want my camera, huh? And you can borrow it right on any condition. Anything you shoot better involve naked flesh or explosions. Bonus points for both. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Alright! <laughs> Alright, now to the side mission that I'm gonna accept for no reason at all. Oh yeah. Kill Foreman. I got no idea who Foreman is because right now I'm gonna complete the main mission. Uh, because of the fact that it's exactly tuned for my level, which is the level 21, so, you know, I can't pass on that. But before that, give me a couple... Alright, I thought that he he's a dead man walking, literally. Anyway, let's go over here. I do not have any iridium. I thought that I got some iridium. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, let's go to Marcus and check what he has, uh, with whatever, what he has got to offer. Uh, this guy, soul rifle, that's not bad, but I'm gonna ignore it, as if I didn't see it just now. Anyway, sometimes over here uh, you might have pretty decent weapons appearing. I didn't want to accept that quest, but doesn't matter. This thing for 2000, I don't really need it, but I'm gonna just uh, buy it for the completionist sort of in purpose. Uh, what did I want to do with these? Oh yeah. I'm gonna shove this into the, the inter... the hell? I do not remember the weapons I got on this character because of the fact that I've been playing quite a bit with my secondary character and uh, these guns are surprisingly similar to each other. I've been playing a lot on my secondary character because um, yeah, I didn't want to progress for on in the story with my main one, because I want to save all of that for uh, the videos, also my reactions and everything. So I've been playing quite a bit with my secondary character, the Maya. So, yeah, I do not exactly remember which guns I get over here. And I gotta say that over there, I actually have quite a few epic looking guns. Seriously, here, it seems I just got the sniper rifle, which is pretty damn good. Also, yeah, I do have a pretty decent shotgun. Although I gotta say that on that siren, I do have a considerably better shotgun. I actually do have a shotgun that fires uh, 15 pellets and it has uh, 103 damage. And that character is actually the same level as I am, so that's kind of surprising. I'm gonna show it over here because soon enough I wanna start playing uh, Psycho and I wanna have it ready for the time. Anyway, the man who will be Jack. Who would be Jack? Who would be Jack? Yeah, that's his name. It's surprising that they are calling me a man. I do understand that the gauge is kind of manly, especially with that roid right shield. I, I, you know, muscular fucking fucking gauge. Why am I calling her Wendy? Huh? It doesn't make any fucking sense. Anyway, I'm still not a bloody man. 
And it seems like the opportunity is exactly the town I was talking previously about. Yeah, it is exactly the same town I was talking about. You know, that little off-coast town. Alright, let's get the light runner. I don't really need uh, the bandit technician. And let's get to opportunity. Alright, there we go. That's the bridge. Travel. Oh. Um, wasn't I supposed to, uh, also give me a second, since Moxie kind of mentioned that camera, I want to look at some dirty pics, because, because I was specifically told not to. to my chambers. You'll need to be Jack. That means passing a bioscan and speaking a password in his voice. If you can kill one of Jack's body doubles in opportunity, I can get you through that door. All right. I need you to snag an orbital drop beacon and some surveyor lures. I'll explain why once you've got them. Oh, and while you're at it, take out some engineers. We need to show the universe this town is as good for your health as a bullet to the face. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm down for that, alright. Uh, did you change? No. Hi there, this is a message from Handsome Jack to the construction workers of Opportunity. You fine gentlemen are building the future. Once the city is done and it's carefully selected citizens are brought in, you'll be able to see the true beauty that opportunity represents. From a distance, that is. If you guys aren't coming anywhere near the city once it's done, <laughs> you can check it out from like, binoculars or something. Alright, that was... <laughs> that was a dick move, Jack. Not that... Uh, I do have a feeling like everything you do is a dick move. Oh! I thought that this is gonna be some kind of a spy mission, but apparently not. Well, hello, engineer. You don't really look like an engineer, though. Oh. Alright, I just absorbed a bloody rocket. Alright, alright, I forget that this character has got the Discord kind of a thingy. Oh, fucking hell. Bloody shield, I hate the iron guys. Man. I can hear more engineers. Oh, that's a power loader. I can hear you. That wasn't, um, yeah, I forgot that this thing has burst fire. God fucking damn it. Um, I don't think I'm the right guy for that. You should be asking Jack about that. He's the one that's mining everything. Oh fucking hell. There is no chance I'm gonna kill this guy. Unless I do this. Of course. What? <laughs> I do have a feeling like I'm in some kind of a fascist fucking country. Jesus! <laughs> Verbal littering! Littering, that, that's, that's something. <laughs> that sounds like something George Orwell would make. Is that a cardboard? Strong cardboard. Anyway, uh, kill Jack's double. Alright. Kind of weird that like this can uh, this town is com almost completely populated by just robots. Yet still, I'm supposed to find like the only guy that's in the entire town that actually lives here. I'm supposed to fucking kill him. Oh, that's an engineer. That's more engineers. Great. Really, the biggest problem of this gun is just how many bullets it fucking wastes. Otherwise, it would be like, 
If it didn't have that burst fire, it would be such an amazing gun. But it doesn't! Also, these guys are like chewing through my she's like fucking crazy. Alright, there we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, I'm gonna heal myself up. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. <clears throat> Jesus. That's a hot loader. Oh, I forgot. I've been calling these guys fucking hot pockets. You. How did you. Alright, I got no idea how the fuck am I almost dead. Firing laser. <clears throat> there we go. Alright, this is gonna take quite some time. Oh yeah, fucking missiles. Are you feeling like I'm kind of dead? Just, just, maybe? I suppose? Uh, oh yeah, they should forgot they should get this in the uh, most accurate of things. Uh, the shotgun I was previously talking about that I have on Maya is actually surprisingly accurate. With that thing, I was able to snipe with that thing. It might have 15 pellets, but it has better accuracy than, than like a sniper rifle, seriously. Should I? Sh uh, yeah, I'm gonna take these secondary missions, even though that probably I won't complete them. But maybe, maybe. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. What? The statues are It's gonna take quite some time until I'll be able to reach uh, the Jack's uh, double. So yeah, I'm gonna take a couple of side missions. Start the anarchy. Is he almost dead? The completionist in me is like, yeah! What RPG loader? I'm out of fucking ammo. <laughs> All right, that was quick. There we go. Oh fucking hell! Yep, I'm kind of losing my health. Just kind of. I probably shouldn't have done that. Where is he? Oh, behind the wall, of course. That was never gonna end. Like, it's an interesting bit of a story, but. Alright, so. Yeah, I'm supposed to listen to these things? Fucking. Jack came to Pandora, he found a world of danger and hardship. 
Jack armed himself to the teeth using the quality armaments of Hyperion, the company he called home. Jack learned of the legendary vault that housed a terrible evil. He defeated many horrors to reach the vault. Hideous monsters and vicious bandits. Isn't this supposed to be the vault? Hmm. Uh, the good old times when he still had his own fucking face. And five years ago, Jack defeated the monster inside the vault, triumphed over the evil treasure seekers, and brought peace to Pandora. With that done, the peace my ass. And like somebody else who kind of told him that. This mysterious alien element flourished across Pandora, and Jack became an overnight trillionaire. Today, Jack, now the owner of the Hyperion Corporation, has dedicated his life to bringing bandit scum to justice. There is only one word to describe what Jack has become to Pandora. A dick. Let the loaders do the lifting. Loaders, let the engineers take bandit fire. This is called teamwork. What? <laughs> Thank you for visiting the Hall of History. Take this tax refund. <clears throat> also, where is the other quest I was supposed to do? Uh 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 uh. This? No. Statesk. Yeah, this thing. As a side mission, I can kind of complete while doing this main mission. It will probably take me some more time to complete it than would normally, but... Eh, who gives a damn? Probably everybody watching me that's getting bored to shit right now, but... Eh, who gives a damn about them? I learned that the more of a dick you are in your life... The more bootloaders you will find. Uh, no. The more of a dig you're in real life. Are you fucking kidding me? Anyway, the more of a dig you're in real life, the easier life you will actually have. It's kind of weird. Like, you know, being nice doesn't actually make your life easier. I used to be real nice back in the day. Fucking saint. But as the time went by, who oh, was here? You found the constructor. Just bring him back up and he'll treat you as an ally. You'll be like his mommy, his gun toting, profanity spewing mommy. Huh. Anyway, I used to back in the day be kind of insane. Like, you know, I pretty much never did anything bad, but eventually I learned that being a dick is much easier. And people treat you the same fucking way. It's still difficult to be a dick. At times. Iron fucking loader. Don't you dare to do that. This is getting good. Yeah, this is getting good. And there's a bull loader right next to me. There we go. He did. Went to Discord. Went to Discord. <laughs> there we go. Discord's over. I'm supposed to escort overseer. Uh, what? Are you doing now? what? <laughs> Fucking hell? Are you kidding me? Where is it? Snot. I'm fucking dead. You made your point. You don't like the statue. I get it. I look a little too badass with my foot in that bandit's face. <laughs> God damn it. That little wee load red just fucking killed me. Man, I hate those guys. Like, seriously, he killed me and he just started flying around. Jesus. What a little annoyance. I can't even save Overseer now. Oh, 
All right. Not a bad start. Love you, bot. Fucking hell. Target me. Rise. Oh, you fell because of the tiny little fucking wee loader. Jesus fuck. And now I deal so much damage. He just flew away. Where's that little shit? I've I've seen a badass constructor. That's what I've seen. All right. Uh, let me get a couple of skill points. Obviously, I want to do this thing or this thing. Um, or this thing, this thing, shooting enemy while. Oh yeah. So I'm supposed to be... Oh, I fucking... Mm. Alright. I'm gonna give running. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna keep on running around here. I'm gonna get back. Or I'm not even gonna complete it at all. Like, this mission is kinda... Nah, not for me. So. What is Surveyor Lur? I didn't know, but two of them are over here. I'm gonna go and grab the one over here first. That's a war loader. Well, screw you, I'm not gonna go around you. I actually do have the camera recording throughout the entire time. It actually records me dying. Take that orbital supply beacon to the big crane past the waterfront quarter. Once you call in a drop, the moonshot will destroy the crane. Should look great on film. I won't survive this. I gotta get back my my shields back up again. <coughs> I'm gonna activate the Discord. Let's run through this place. All right, there we go. And what am I supposed to do now? I'm, you know what, fuck it, I'm gonna complete the main mission. The man who would be Jack. <laughs> Holy shit. Really? That's one of the body doubles Jack uses to confuse assassins and impress his underlings. Oh my god! I thought that he's such he's such an easy kill, but nope, <laughs> that guy's got a shit ton of shields. <coughs> More precisely, something was giving him the shield. I've died so many times throughout this video on just my stupid fucking mistakes, man. Alright, let's go back there and let's hopefully Hopefully, kill that guy. Maybe there was a chance for that. Also, my budgies are kind of waking up again in the kitchen. That's not good. By the way, yes, I actually do have my budgies in the kitchen because of the fact that I got a single room flat. Oh, well, hello there. Headshot Conga or not? There we go. More kills. Where am I getting shot at from? 
There we go. He dead. Kill bandit. Yeah, sure. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's a warloader. Ah, slag. Fucking hell. More hurt for the Discord. There we go. I do like the fact that this Discord thingy has got actually new voice lines. Don't you dare. Start spinning. That's a bull loader. And that's another war loader. All right. Die. Oh, that was the most monotone voice ever. Wow, what an easy fucking kill. Huh? What the hell? Where are you shooting at, boy? All right. Is he like running around? Oh, the hell. There we go. <clears throat> oh, he dropped a gun. So your life wasn't entirely worthless. Oh fucking hell, I'm running directly into another combat engineer. Thankfully I got a shotgun so it doesn't really fucking matter if I run into him or not. Alright. That was such a blast, I actually got a lag from that. <coughs> Alright. There's still one gun loader. There we go. Now to find his double. What? Where is he? Alright, that's worthless, worthless, worthless. Some stuff that is also worthless. And no jack double inside. Um what? And here it comes, my allergies! <clears throat> Where is he? Am I supposed to, like, go underground and... I've been here previously. Alright, that haven't killed him. Noob, and I got full H, full shield. There we go. Alright, there we go. And narrow kill. And another bull loader. Fuck. Have I destroyed his shield? No, I didn't. There we go, he dead. And I got no fucking shit. Amazing. I almost shot him. I just... What the hell? Are you kidding me? Oh, that was so close. That was so close. <coughs> just a random question. Where the hell... Is they're supposed to be Jack's double, but I can't fucking find him. All right, where is he? Seriously, don't you dare to tell me that I just randomly, like when I died against him back then, that was like the only chance I would get to kill him. Come 
There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. What just hit me? I'm wrong, but I have a feeling like I'm dealing literally no damage to the constructor. It's not like I do have a feeling, I do know that I'm dealing no damage. I thought that like the corrosion will deal like bonus damage to him, but apparently not. He can't hit me over here. Bandit in proximity, he just keeps on saying that. Whoa. That's one hell of an explosion. Alright, where the fuck is he? Am I seriously gonna have to like destroy the entire opportunity to just find his double? Really? Where is he? Alright. They're like... You are here, yeah I know that. Does this thing open? Nope. It's like, it's probably underneath me, but I got no idea how to get there. Hmm. Maybe something opens up. I'm just gonna keep on running around. I've been here previously. Let's have this square. Here is a bit of an underground lair, but what the hell? Oh, fucking loot midget. Amazing. Alright, I'm kinda dying at a ridiculous rate. But Hot Pocket saved my life. Thank God. Random, not anymore. Whoa. Right. Not bad, not bad. There we go. The gun loader is down, but really, that's getting me kind of annoyed. Where is he? There is he. That's one of the being shot at. Grab the pocket watch device he dropped. It echoes his bio signal. That pocket watch also records audio. Success. Jack loved to listen to the praise of his underlings. We need to create a voice modulator so you can speak in Jack's voice. Get to an info kiosk. How did I not hit him? Alright. Use info kiosk. <sighs> alright, alright, alright. Did you know that some people on this planet still believe in silly superstitions? Like We're being angels, attacked! Bandits, and ancient Jack alien warriors? We like to call them bandits. Yes, this is going to work. If I get a few more samples of Jack's voice, I can make a voice modulator for you. You need to get more voice samples from other info kiosks. Alright, so... Oh, god damn it. Well... Well, this is gonna take a while. This is gonna take a while, seriously. And we're already at over 30 minutes. 
And there's only more and more of these guys. Jesus fuck. Alright, about me. I think so. Anyway, I'm gonna end the episode right about here because we are already at over 30 minutes and until I'll collect all of those voice samples, it's gonna take a while, so... Yeah, I'm gonna leave around here. I hope you enjoy my little philosophical window that I've had over there uh, because it's probably never gonna happen again. Anyway, this has been Kevin Egg and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.